Okay, so we're at the nail shop right now, and last time I got this color, but I was looking for like a darker red vampy color. So we're gonna go with 633, because I just didn't end up liking this. It wasn't as dark as I was used to, so I'm waiting for the nail tech to get here, because I always beat everybody to all the appointments, because the early bird catches the worm. But yeah, 633, that's what we're going with today. So my greedy butt is back at Taco Bell. I just went and got an order, and then, they forgot my drink, so now I gotta go back. Um, obviously this is the same day that I got my nails done because look at my new nails. But I told them that I needed um, meat for Gigi, right? I was like, hey, can you guys add chicken? But after I placed the order and got up to the window, I was like, hey, can I add a, um, an order of meat for my dog? And so she um, looked at me and she was like, you gotta pay for it. Girl, I <laughs> What, I thought you were just gonna give me the meat for free? I'm like, these people are crazy these days. So she looks over and she's like, she wants a, she wants some meat for her dog. Yes, I do. Yes, yes, I do want some meat for her dog. Damn, did I just, I gotta roll this around. And then I pull off, I pull off, and you're so worried about my dog getting meat, you forgot my drink. So now I gotta come right back through your drive-thru, ma'am. We're about to go right back through this drive-thru because you didn't um, give me my drinks. I need my Baja Blast. And my husband, he got chalupas, and he got, what did he get with his? I just got him Mountain Dew, I didn't even ask him. I don't know, Taco Bell got your girl on a hold right now, but yeah, how you how you gonna add to, because I want meat for my dog, and then you forgot to give me my drink, so I'm about to roll back through this drive-thru. You see, you rushing me, and you're not even doing your job right. Mommy, not, I'm gonna be nice. Are you checking in with your mobile app to earn rewards? May I take your order? Hi, ma'am. I just came through, but I've, you guys forgot to give me my drinks. Oh, okay. Come on around. Okay. Like, I'm being nice, though. Yeah, Pat, give me that Baja Blast. Thank you. I was trying to gonna catch you, but I couldn't. I already sped off, so it's okay. Thank you, sorry about that. That's okay, that's okay. I was craving this, so I need oh, to come okay. back. See, I was, she was nice, but I was just like, she must not have any pets, because whenever I go someplace and I can get something for Gigi, I'll, I'm gonna get something for Gigi too, like she's part of the family. So I got her some chicken, because she's such a, for a Shih Tzu, well no, not for a Shih Tzu, all Shih Tzus, most Shih Tzus are very picky eaters. And this girl thinks like she's like legit a princess. Like she thinks, I mean, you know, Shih Tzus are, um, oh shoot, you're going a little too fast, I'm about to, uh, Shih Tzus are, um, they were like royalty dogs in China. So there's like a whole like history lesson behind Shih Tzu's. And I don't know, these little these little assholes think they're still royalty because Gigi, like she is super, super picky. Like I even bought her the farmer's dog. I hate people out here don't know you can make a right on red. Yes, you can make a right on red. What are you doing? Um, I bought her the farmer's dog. She ate it for two days and she stopped eating it. So I had to stop the subscription. I'm like, girl like i'm not giving and then i tried doing the whole home cooking the whole home cooking of the food right i was like buying turkey i got i felt all cute i was chopping up carrots i was putting like meat stuff in it like i read every sweet potato everything dog can, i'm like do you know how many dogs would be grateful to eat the stuff that I, I i give you that i like bend over backwards and give you every single day and she just does not care she got that little underbite going on the dish she does not care but anyways let me go home and smash it. What is up with me and Taco Bell lately? Is this something that's come, that comes with menopause? Like you just crave weird stuff like pregnancy? I don't know. I don't know. But guess who wanted Taco Bell when I um when I bought this? He wanted it because I texted him. I said, do you want some Taco Bell? He's like, sure. You know what I don't like? I don't like answering questions like text messages in two parts. So if you say, if I said, do you want Taco Bell? Your response should be, sure, can you get me a whatever, whatever. So we put sure. So I'm at the stoplight, I'm looking at this. So I put, am I supposed to read your mind and guess what you want? Like, what do you want from Taco Bell? And then he's like, let me look for the, at the menu. Taco Bell's menu is not that <laughs> extravagant to where a person doesn't know what they want from Taco Bell. But he ended up getting the chalupas. I think men be trying to drive us crazy. I don't like answering two-part text messages. Like, put all the information 
like in there. I hate when people who text me and say, hey. Okay, I say, hey. Like you want something, right? You, you're saying, hey, because you want something. Hey, how are you? Do you, whatever, whatever. I do not, that's so, does that just irritate me or does that, that irritate you too? Yeah, don't just send me, hey, like, what, what is the contents of, of this text? Like, what, what do you need? What can, what may I assist you with? Like, mm, people are weird. Oh, the garage is open. So, all right. So they are outside. All right. I'm going to go and I'm about to go eat. I'll check in with you guys a little bit later. Vlogtober so fun. Mommy brought you something. Um, chicken. Mommy brought you something. Oh, I'm coming. I'm coming. I'm coming right now. Mommy brought you. Can you smell it? Okay. So I'm in some big bonnet. I got some more flexi rods today, a thicker one. I, I think your girl got these heatless curls down pack. I really think so. But I've already taken my Lunesta. It's not even eight o'clock yet, but I gotta be at the airport like at 545. I can't wait to see the daughter and the grandson tomorrow and the daughter's best friend tomorrow. I think we may do a video um, that's like a Q and A of just mother and daughter in military life because I don't know if I'd share it with you, but my daughter's in the Air Force, I'm in the Navy. So I was thinking it, was, it would be fun, like when I got there, if I could get her to do it, we could like sit up but after we put the baby to sleep and kind of just like have a glass of wine and just talk about our different experiences um, in the military. And then also when I found out she was pregnant two years ago, she was in the car with her best friend because I guess her best friend was her hype man because she didn't know how I was gonna react, but I think I reacted pretty cool, so I'm gonna ask for that on camera. I'm gonna have some questions ready for a Q&A. So we'll see, we'll see. Let me know if it's something you guys wanna see, but yeah, I will be out there for about a week and a half, so I definitely have to keep on bringing the content. I'm hoping we're going to the pumpkin patch and doing some other things, but um, your girl's tired. I always go to bed early though. Unless I'm just scrolling, I'll scroll till I fall asleep, but I'm tired. So heading to GA tomorrow, can't wait. <laughs> ATL Georgia. You know, every time like I go there, I'm like, I always hear that beat. Doom, 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 doom. If you know, you know. If you know, you know. But I'm delirious because I'm tired. But all right, see you guys tomorrow. So this is the fit, outfit for the airport. I still have a few minutes to kill. I wanted to make sure my nose, my face was clean, but that's what we're looking like this morning. Oh my God. Uh, let me go get, find the chair and sit down before this plane takes off. Another view, simple outfit. Yep. Yeah, I got it. Um, let's see, let's... Oh, these Trader Joe bags? Um, yes, I know no groceries about me. Okay, well, let's put that back there, and then... Say hi, guys! Hello. So, you may see breakfast lunch here. He needs to eat snacks there, and then he can get them. So, what time are we going to go pick him up? Um, he eats snack at 2.30, so we can go get him at... 245. Okay, I suppose that'll work. It's going to. <laughs> I paid for a date here. But I was excited. We'll save the excitement for 245. So the daughter hooked me up. What's it? What is this? Is this egg? No, mushroom, right? Mushroom, some brown cilantro lime rice, mm. some asparagus, and then some chicken with peppers and onions. Yum. 
So I'm about to eat because I just got off the plane, just got here and I'm starving. This looks delicious. Okay, so I just scarfed all that food down. I, I was starving. Like I was, I don't know why I thought a protein shake would just not give me the jitters, but when I got here, like I was like shaking because I was from, from hunger, having hunger. Is that a thing, hunger shakes? I definitely had it, but I've unpacked. I pretty much gave my daughter all the things that I brought her um, from Trader Joe's here. Um, her dad sent her a gold bracelet. So, oh shoot, blocked you guys up. But I think hers matches mine. Like I have three that I wear every day. These never come off. I think she has one, like my middle one. I don't know. I gotta go downstairs and check, but I brought her that. And then we're gonna go pick up my grandson here in about another like hour and a half from daycare. So yeah, after I pick him up, um, I'm probably gonna end the vlog off here. Cause I have no idea what we're doing tomorrow, but your girl is tired. In the middle of the flight from, it was only like a 50 minute flight. Like I have to catch a shuttle from there to where my daughter lives which is like an hour and a half ride. So it's longer, it was a longer shuttle ride than it was an actual plane ride. So I'm just getting older, I'm, I'm beat. But yeah, I can't wait to see my grandson. I can't wait to see him. I already, he's been watching Finding Nemo. So I ordered him from Amazon some Finding Nemo to, um, bath toys they get here tomorrow. So he's gonna be super excited. It's time to spoil his ass. I think you only tried that, I mean this one, not that one. I think I tried both of them, both of them. Okay, well let me look. We are looking for the Sir Davis whiskey out here, but I don't think that they have it. And let's see. Ciroc is the safest bet with us, so I think we'll do Ciroc. I wish I had the bigger bottles out here. Let's see. Are you happy to see Mimi? I see you. I see you, Carrie. Let me see, where are you? Where's, where's my baby? Where is he? Where'd he go? There he goes. Ah! 